Today, I will be showing you the difference between anti-glare glass and regular glass. Which is often called museum glass or anti-reflection glass, there are so many different applications where anti-glare glass is vitally important. Hi, I'm Amanda with TwoInMirrors.com. So what even is museum glass? Museum glass is an anti-reflection glass, so then it doesn't have that nasty glare to it. This type of glass is typically used in a picture frame or display cases in a museum. You may have heard it as Army Ron glass. Army Ron glass has clear transparency, reducing the reflections. This means you can look at a picture or a piece of artwork with no weird reflections from the lights in the room. Not to mention, but this glass has the best anti-reflection quality on the market. Have you ever heard of this type of glass? If you have, comment down below and where you've seen it at. Even if you haven't seen it before, where do you think it is? Let me tell you a little bit more about the Amiron glass. It is highly scratch resistant, easier to clean, long durability, and is weatherproof. With all of these great characteristics, it is outstanding in overall performance. It can even be installed outside. I have some samples and a display case to show you the anti-glare in action. You can put this glass in many environments such as your family photos, shop windows, lobbies, facades, and restaurants. Could you imagine having a terrible reflection on your picture frame or even in your lobby at work? Anywhere that you need that great quality, it's a perfect fit for you. Did you know that if a picture or a painting was exposed to UV radiation, that it tends to fade rather quickly? Luckily, this glass protects the painting from UV radiation, which makes it perfect for multi-million dollar paintings and pieces. Scientists say that the Mona Lisa has faded because of the glass that it was stored in. Let that sink in. Where would you put this glass at? Let me know in the comments down below. I hope you guys enjoyed learning about museum glass with me. I bet you didn't know that there is a specific kind of glass that went into these installations. Did you? Did you really? Next time you go window shopping, take a look at the windows. Can you tell if there's a glare or not? Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about the one and only anti-reflective glass. The best on the market. If you guys haven't checked out our recent video about what is museum glass, make sure you check that out in the description below. And while you're down there, make sure to hit that subscribe button. In that video, we do a brief summary and a description about Amiron glass. How does the anti-reflection even work? Well, you're just gonna have to keep watching to find out. I'm Amanda with Two Way Mirrors. Okay, so how does the anti-reflective glass even work? Some of you guys may not even know this, but you actually might have this glass on you right now. Your glasses! If you have anti-reflection qualities on your specs, then it is more than likely the Amiron glass. Most of our technology and devices uses the anti-reflection coatings. Without it, it wouldn't be as efficient, small, and powerful as it is today. If artwork was framed in standard glass, then it would fade and lose color over time. The glass is dip-coated on both sides of the glass. Okay, so get this. Clear glass does not allow 91% of the light to pass through, while this glass blocks out 97% of the light, but it blocks about 99% of the harmful UVs that comes to the glass, making the art behind the glass remain brighter and clearer for much longer. It's practically protecting the art. Amiron glass reduces reflections by over 85%. Making Amiron the best glass for when you need protection and also UV protection as well. With the low iron qualities, it is a tint-free application. The low iron means it will not have a green tint to it like the standard float glass does. You can use this type of glass for many types of insulation, such as framing pictures, in museums to protect million dollar paintings, art pieces in your home, aquariums, even pinball machines. It's so much easier to play when you actually see the ball. Oh yeah, in jewelry cases, to show them in the absolutely best light. Food display cases are also a thing, as well as storefronts. And that is all I have for you guys today. If you guys have any questions about Amiron glass, be sure to leave them in the comments below and I will get right back to you. 
What type of videos do you guys want to see next? Let me know. I'm Amanda with Two Way Mirrors, and I'll see you guys in our next video. Work.